Good morning. Today we'll be doing the liturgy of the hours morning prayer for Sunday, June 26. Today is the 13th week in ordinary time. Let's go through the pages. For the breviary, our hymn is found on page 1191. Antiphon Psalms and reading begin at 688. Christian prayer book is hymn number 14. And Antiphon Psalms and reading begin at 707. Let's have a moment of silence as we begin our prayer. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Alleluia. As morning breaks, I look to you, O God, to be my strength this day. Alleluia. O God, you are my God, for I long, for you my soul is thirsting. My body pines for you, like a dry, weary land without water. So I gaze on you in the sanctuary to see your strength and your glory. For your love is better than life. My lips will speak your praise, so I will bless you all my life. In your name, I will lift up my hands. My soul shall be filled as with a banquet. My mouth shall praise you with joy. On my bed, I remember you. On you, I muse, I muse through the night, for you have been my help. In the shadow of your wings I rejoice. My soul clings to you. Your right hand holds me fast. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. As morning breaks, I look to you, O God, to be my strength this day. Alleluia. From the midst of the flames, the three young men cried out with one voice, Blessed be God, Alleluia. Bless, Bless the, the Lord, Lord, all your works of the Lord. Praise and exalt Him above all forever. Angels of the Lord, bless the Lord. You heavens, bless the Lord. All your waters above the heavens, bless the Lord. All your hosts of the Lord, bless the Lord. Sun and moon, bless the Lord. Stars of heaven, bless the Lord. Every shower and dew, bless the Lord. All you winds, bless the Lord. Fire and heat, bless the Lord. Cold and chill, bless the Lord. 
Dew and rain, bless the Lord. Frost and chill, bless the Lord. Ice and snow, bless the Lord. Nights and days, bless the Lord. Light and darkness, bless the Lord. Lightnings and clouds, bless the Lord. Let, Let the earth bless the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Mountains and hills, bless the Lord. Everything growing from the earth, bless the Lord. You springs, bless the Lord. Seas and rivers, bless the Lord. You dolphins and all water creatures, bless the Lord. All you birds on the air, bless the Lord. All you beasts, wild and tame, bless the Lord. You sons of men, bless the Lord. O Israel, bless, bless the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Priests of the Lord, bless the Lord. Servants of the Lord, bless the Lord. Spirits and souls of the just, bless the Lord. Holy men of humble heart, bless the Lord. Hananiah, Azariah, Mishael, bless the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Let us bless the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Let us praise and exalt him above all forever. Blessed are you, Lord, in the firmament of heaven. Praise worthy and glorious and exalted above all forever. From the midst of the flames, the three young men cry out with one voice, Blessed be God, Alleluia. Let the people of Zion rejoice in their King, Alleluia. Sing a new song to the Lord, His praise in the assembly of the faithful. Let Israel rejoice in its maker. Let Zion's sons exult in their king. Let them praise His name with dancing and make music with timbrel and harp. For the Lord takes delight in His people. He crowns the poor with salvation. Let the faithful rejoice in their glory. Shout for joy and take their rest. Let, Let the praise of God be on their lips and a two-edged sword in their hand. To deal out vengeance to the nations and banishment on all the peoples, to bind their kings in chains and their nobles in feathers of iron, to carry out the sentence preordained. This honor is for all his faithful. Glory, Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Let the people of Zion rejoice in their King. Alleluia. A reading from the book of Revelation. Salvation is from our God, who is seated on the throne and from the Lamb. Praise and glory, wisdom and thanksgiving and honor, power and might to our God forever and ever. Amen. The word of the Lord. Thanks, Thanks be to God. Salvation. The word salvation is something we've heard before that if we can understand it more, we will probably drop to our knees in awe. Salvation deserves a reaction from us, a reaction of thanksgiving for the gift of everlasting peace. Many forget that what they are working hard for is to get peace. Peace of mind that our future is taken care of. 
earthly bodies often invest short term. Our immortal spirit is in terms of eternal life. This makes it a no-brainer once we see this truth. Salvation is deliverance from the consequence of sin. Sin separates us from God. That easily comes significant when we face death. But anyone who's made peace with God shouldn't fear death. A relationship with Jesus gives us the path fit for the kingdom of God. Christ, Son of the Living God, have mercy on us. Christ, Son of the Living God, have mercy on us. You are seated at the right hand of the Father. Have, have mercy, mercy on us. us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Christ, Christ Son, Son of, of the Living God, God have, have mercy on, on us. Jesus, turning, saw the woman and said, Take courage, daughter. Your faith has saved you. Alleluia. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets, he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was his oath he swore to our father Abraham to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his way to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadows of death and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Jesus, turning, saw the woman and said, Take courage, daughter. Your faith has saved you. Hallelujah. Christ is the sun that never sets, the true light that shines on every man. Let us call out to him in praise. Lord, Lord you, you are, are our life, life and our salvation. salvation. Creator of the stars, we thank you for your gift, the first rays of the dawn. And, and we, we commemorate, commemorate your resurrection. resurrection. May your Holy Spirit teach us to do your will today. And, and may your wisdom guide us always. It's Sunday. Give us the joy of gathering as your people around the table of your word and your body. From our hearts, we thank you for your countless blessings. At this time, let's take a moment of silence to lift up our prayers and petitions to our Lord Jesus Christ. Dear Lord Jesus, we lift up to you our prayers and our petitions 
together with the prayers and petitions of each and every one who are praying with us this morning. We ask, dear Jesus, that you hear and answer each and every prayer as we say, Lord, you are our life and our salvation. Lord, remember us when you come into your kingdom and teach us how to pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Let us pray. O God, who through the grace of adoption chose us to be children of light, grant we pray that we may be wrapped in the darkness of error, but always be seen in, to stand in the bright light of truth. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May the Almighty God bless you, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace. Glorify the Lord by your life. Thanks be to God. Thank, Thank you for praying, praying with us. We hope, we hope you can you join, join us again, us again tomorrow. tomorrow. Same, same time, same place, same channel. Have, have a great, great day. day.